what's up everybody welcome back to the next video my name is alex and we are back playing some more seven days to die yay i totally remember what i was doing don't oh god 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 nope 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 oh no no why why? Why? Every single time. Oh, welcome back to the game. If if you guys didn't remember how 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 punishing this game is, may this serve as a reminder. Do they just keep running out the back door? Because that would be really convenient. <laughs> I just came from playing some Minecraft on Red Overdoses. Oh, here we go. Alright, um, didn't really plan for this scenario to happen. Um, okay, one of them got up, it looks like. I can't tell. Uh, Red Overdose on Twitch, who has a Minecraft server that he's playing from. Oh, the Gala got out! And I was just playing some Minecraft on his server and working on the hub town, and I was like, I gotta get, I gotta go play this seven days. So I'm here. We are playing this. And it was a solid start. I feel like this is a solid start. I mean, you know. This is a good sign, if anything. Okay, so this is the reality of the situation that we're currently in. And I looked it up online just to confirm. Horde day is indeed day 28. It's day 28. Okay? We know that now. We need to be making concrete blocks. What's our max amount? Okay, so let's go 50. And let's see what we can do with that. So basically, it's morning of day 27, night of day 28, it's happened. Are they all still back there? What are they? What are they? What on earth are they doing? Why did they do that? Oh, there they go. Alright, well that'll work for me, that's fine. Okay. Um, so we have some stragglers, let's take care of the stragglers. How are you guys doing? I had- <clears throat> why are you still running? You shouldn't still be running. Oh, this is not gonna be good. We're gonna get back into a corner. Um, oh no, we're not good. So... Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, jeez. Why can't I hit him? What's wrong with me? <laughs> I wish I was back playing. Oh, I can jump out of there. Hmm. Um, I was gonna say back playing Minecraft. There we go. Ahem. <clears throat> now that my mind is not getting sidetracked, which it totally will be, but nonetheless, we will try to continue on. I had a little bit of a cold this last week. I've had a little bit of a, I've had a little bit of a week. Okay, well they just ripped that up in like two seconds. Uh, I had a little bit of a week. Oh my goodness. Oh, thanks. Um, I had a little bit of a week. But, I mean, who who doesn't have weeks? We all have weeks. I've had a little bit of a week. I had a cold. I just had, like, thing after thing after thing after thing that would not go right for me. And I'm like, psh, whatevs. You get through the week, you keep moving on. So, <clears throat> if my voice sounds a little scratchy, that's why. Uh, but it was a weird, like, 24-hour kind of thing. It's like, when you have a cold, and then it's just gone. You know? I don't know. So, but I'm, I'm making it through. And we're gonna get lots of seven days to die out and ready to go. So that's, that's to be excited about. <clears throat> um, okay, I need to, like, get myself... Okay, so some people in the comments were asking if... Um, if three is gonna be low enough. And it might not be. It might be. I'm not sure. But I think we should try it and just see what happens. Um, okay, I need to dig this out here a little bit more. Did I just, did that mess that up? Is that, is that gonna mess that up? I don't know. I don't think so. Please don't mess it up. Please don't mess it up. Please don't mess it up. Oh, this makes me nervous. 
Now the trick here is that we need to make sure, no matter what, we need to, we have enough concrete to be able to go around the entirety of the base. If we do not have that, then this was all for nothing. Don't worry, we have one. Um, okay. So, how you guys doing? What's new? You seen any good shows lately? This concrete thing is going to be... It's going to be super rough. I think okay, we're gonna need to do a top layer on this, obviously, because they're just gonna be able to jump up. What am I doing? No, I don't want to do that. Oh, you guys are calculating along with me, and you're like, nope, and I'm like, yep, yeah, that's gonna be a big no, isn't it? Yep, yeah, okay. All right, I see, I see where our problem is going to going to be. Um, yeah, okay. Let's go make a little bit more concrete. Let's do that. Uh, I've really enjoying your guys' comments, by the way, and all the subscribers. I think we're at 56 subscribers now, which is amazing. So thank you guys so much. It's so exciting. It's one of those things. I don't know. It's weird. It's like you work on something and you share it with people. What's that sound? And and then and then people are like, yeah, I dig what you're doing. And you're like, yay! It's a great feeling. It's just it's really cool because I like gaming with other people, and especially when it comes to this game. Like, if it wasn't for YouTube and Twitch, I wouldn't know anybody that plays this game. Which is why I first started streaming on Twitch, like, two years ago. Because I wanted a, I wanted a game with other people. Oh my goodness, I'm, like, playing this like I'm playing Minecraft. Okay. Okay. I have lots of stone. Okay, we need to make cement. Like, right now. We need all the cement. I need to empty my inventory. So keep the comments coming, because I love to see them. Um, and I'm curious, if anybody knows, please let me know. A couple of videos back, there was a video, like, most of these videos are getting around 17 or 20 views, I think, for each one. And then there was, like, this one random one, the first one where we're digging the trench, that has, like, 65 or 70 views out of nowhere. Does anybody know why? Because I was watching it, and I was like... And the video before is like 25, and the video after is like 25, but there's like one video that's like number 47 in the series, or something like 48, 46, I don't know, something like that. And it's the first one with the word trench in the title of it. And I was like, are people just really into digging trenches? Is that a thing? I don't know. I'm just, I'm curious as to what, what the heck happened. I don't have any stone. I don't have any stone. I have 11 stone. Okay. Okay. All right. Nobody panic. Okay. Stop it. Stop panicking. Just, just don't. We're gonna be okay, you guys. Everything is gonna be fine. We totally, totally have more than enough time to make like 500 pieces of concrete, so don't worry. And you know what? If they destroy this base, well, we'll just have to rebuild and try again in the next one. You know, because there's an, always another horde day coming after this one. That will be significantly more difficult, of course, but, you know. Hopefully by then we'll be able to make this many traps. I feel like the days are going by so fast. I think, like, at some point I shortened the server time to be 60 minutes. So that, like, there would be some kind of, like, routine way I could make, like, certain length videos. So, like, 20, 20, 20 minutes, something like that. And I know I really rarely stick to that. But that was kind of the idea. And then so I think it made the day go way faster. And now it's going, like, way, way faster. And I'm getting stressed out. I'm not really getting that stressed out. It's still, it's all fun. But I'm just saying, like... Maybe this is just, is this how I always respond, like, the day before something stressful is about to happen in the game and I just completely freak out? <sighs> Maybe. I'm just gonna assume that it's gonna be fine. If we can just get some more stone, then we can make the concrete. How much stone have we gotten so far? Oh. Oh, uh, we have lots of stone. <laughs> Did anybody else notice that? Why didn't you guys tell me? <sighs> Just sitting here saying it. <sighs> okay, I feel like significantly less stressed out now. Okay. Um. Okay. It's fine. Everything, everything's gonna be fine. I don't know where my food or drink or anything like that is at, but I think it's gonna be fine. So let's just, let's just make up all the rest of these. Let's just do that. 
If we can, like, if they only destroy, like, one or two areas of concrete, then that'll be okay. As long as they don't take everything out, which they won't do. We're gonna do this because it just makes the most sense. Otherwise, they're gonna jump across and they're gonna get across. I might even put up, like, a... I might even... I don't know what I'm gonna do. We're just figuring it out. We're just figuring it out. Yes, 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 yes. I've been watching The Big Bang Theory a lot lately. Oh god, I almost misplaced that. Oh, that scared me so much. It's like one single block would be just a travesty in my mind. Do you know what I mean? Anybody know when Alpha 17's coming out? <laughs> Okay, let's fix this side over here. Did I keep the deer tay? No, I did not keep the deer tay. Why would I have kept the deer tay? Oh my goodness, I keep like double doubling, like to run forward and then forgetting that I'm not playing Minecraft and then I'm like, oh yeah, it's shift. Oh, I did it again, right as I said it. Uh, uh. Minecraft is fun, you guys. I'm just saying, you know. I came to this game from playing Minecraft, and the only difference that I was able to notice was was the graphical difference, which, okay, yeah, obviously it's like a pretty significant difference. Not gonna say it's not or anything, but it's very similar. And if you like Seven Days to Die, you're probably gonna like Minecraft. Personally, I think that. I mean, I was just playing Minecraft on Red Overdose's server, and it's totally different in so many ways. Like, A, you don't have the waves. I feel like we've talked about this before. You don't have the waves of zombies. You don't have any of that kind of stress happening. But you also don't have the constraints of like, you know, I want to use the word gravity, but that's not right. Physics, you don't have to worry about things collapsing because they don't have proper structure. So therefore you can build massive castles in like the sky. The colors are really dynamic and beautiful and they have stained glass and they have all these different sort of options. So it's not this kind of harsh zombie world where this is like the same, but this is way more survival. That being said, Minecraft does have challenges. It does have the Ender Dragon, and it has a whole bunch of other like crazy kind of stuff that you can do. So there is a, there is a place for it. You know, don't think there isn't. There is a place for it. One entire minute. Ugh. No. So is anybody else, just out of curiosity, feeling very like they want to eat terrible foods? Like, I'm a person who, like, is so focused in on, like, trying to eat healthy foods and stuff like that over the summer. Not always successful. Uh, but all of a sudden, winter, well, it's not winter, it's fall, but in Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, where I reside, it is rainy and it is cool out and it is, like, already sweater weather. And I, quite frankly, like, woke up a bit stressed out today and I was like, I just want to order a Domino's pizza. Now, I'm pretty sure that that was influenced by watching Mukbangs on YouTube last night, where people were, like, ordering Domino's pizzas, <laughs> which I just came across. I didn't even mean to. If you guys don't know what a Mukbang is, I feel like I should explain it. It's, like, people who, like, get these, like, crazy meals or food and they eat them and they're not always crazy, but most of the time it is. I think, I don't know where the source of it is. I'm not even going to guess. Um, who, who originally started it? What was the culture related to starting it? Um, but uh, I think it comes out of Asia and I think that it was like this huge thing and then it went to America and then that was like a huge thing and people basically will order like five Domino's pizzas and just like snack away and like chat on, chat on the video. And YouTubers that I watch and enjoy already have started doing this. So it's not like I sought this out. I was like, oh, what is this video? And then I was like, oh my God, this person just ordered like my dream meal. You know, and then it makes me really hungry, and then the next day I'm thinking about it, I'm like, oh, man. You know, could you really use one of those Domino's pizzas? Yep. But I didn't do it. You know what I did instead? Instead, I was like, I'm going to need some kind of comfort food because I'm having one of those stressed out days where I just want to, like, you know, game and chill out a little bit and not be too stressed out. So I made mashed potatoes, and it was delicious. <laughs> Like, it's one of those things where if you haven't, it's like mashed, it's like hot chocolate is another kind of similar thing, I think, is, is this, is this light on? No, there we go. Um, mashed potatoes are like, especially mashed, mashed potatoes with cheese on them, is so good. It's so good. It is totally one of those meals that like, if you're wanting to just, what's going on with this wall? No, 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 no. We don't need that. Is this straight? No, it's not. How do I... No. No, no. 
Don't mess with me. This doesn't look right though. Where's Heva? I don't know how to do this. That looks definitely wrong. Why is that weird? Do I just have to straighten it out? <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> what error? I forgot about this part of it. Nope, don't need that. Thank you. Um, but yeah. So I was tempted to order pizza, but I did not. Or it's like make homemade pizza, you know? Domino's pizza is not very good for you, even though it is delicious. I haven't had any kind of pizza like that in like a year. Um, you know, because I just get bad stomach aches from it, really. That's, that's really what it is. I mean, it's, there's a logical reason behind it. So, yeah. I made mashed potatoes and they were really good. I like winter because it's a time where you can like get into a big cozy sweater and like eat mashed potatoes and be like burr and make like a nice hot chocolate. I really like that about winter. Summertime like you just it's not that's not that's not what it's about. You know, summertime I want to have like some kind of smoothie, you know, and go outside and be in the sunshine. And every summer I'm like I'm going to like make sure that I like go out and work out and the I don't work out. I just feel like I will start, you know? I'm like, I'm gonna make it. It's in the summertime, I'm always out and I'm swimming and I'm camping and I'm doing all this stuff. So I don't, I wouldn't even bother like working out. I've never been a person that's really ever in my entire life ever worked out. I'm more somebody who'll like go for a walk, go for a swim, you know, or any variety of things that I've done for exercise in the past. But I always think, you know, I'm, I'm gonna just keep walking. I'm gonna get into walking this winter, you know? Get that cardiovascular going, feel really good about it. But I never do, you know why? Because I always forget how terrible it is when it's raining. It freaking sucks, man. It's not good at all. It's cold. It's wet. The bottom of my jeans get wet. That sucks. This is why I hibernate. Apparently, it is known amongst my friends that I, if you, if you call me and you're like, hey, let's go do something, I'm gonna probably say no if it's between like October and like March. <laughs> and I, I apparently come out of my hibernation in March. And people actually recognize this as a thing. And I'm like, why don't people invite me to do stuff? And they're like, because they know you won't come out. Because you hate, okay, first of all, because it's like, usually people are going out at the end of their day, so it's dark, which I'm cool with nighttime because I'm like a night person, but you go out, especially if you've been out in the daytime and you've come home and they're like, come out, like, you, you, the bottom of your jeans are wet, which is just the worst feeling in the entire world, you know, like, it just is, I hate that so much, it's cold and it's wet, and you just want to change out of your jeans and put on some warm pajamas and you know or as, as, as sleeping guy uh my boyfriend calls them like door pants you know where you have to like change into clothes you'd wear outside definitely don't wear jeans indoors oh uh you know definitely the minute i come in the door i'm immediately changing it to like some kind of more comfortable pant like material so yeah it's not for me it's just it's just not for me but every year I still tell myself that I'm going to go out and I'm going to go walking and then the rain's coming. I'm like, no, I'm good. Honestly, I'll be in here. I'll be fine. As soon as like April, May comes out, like I will be camping. It's all good. But maybe, you know what I'm thinking maybe I should do? Maybe I should take up like swimming because I do like swimming. So maybe if I start swimming, then it'll be, I can sit in the hot tub after. That's always nice, you know, and I like swimming. And maybe that, I don't know, tell me in the comments below what you guys do for exercise. Because exercise is important at some point of the year, even if it's just in the summer. <laughs> you know, it is a thing, but I would like to, you know, it's really for me, like I deal with anxieties I've talked about before. So there's, there's like, a, we, everybody knows, like there's a massive benefit to exercising when you have anxiety. It's like a huge connection. It lets all these like endorphins and all these other things come out, like the runner's high or whatever, you know, you get that. And then that actually decreases your anxiety over time. If you're just like inside gaming, not wanting to go outside, it's definitely going to make you feel worse. Um, now I have school, so obviously at times I am forced to go outside, unfortunately, but, um, you know, until until uh, <laughs> until I have to go for some kind of class, I am staying in. Um, or maybe going to Starbucks. I do big Starbucks to like study and stuff. But anyways, I'm all over the place. I'm all over the place with this today. It's just one of those things I haven't recorded in a couple of days. I've been laid up. I've been sick, and I am uh, not gonna panic about the fact that it's day 27 and we're still not done this dag nabbit trench. But I think it's gonna be okay. So yeah, probably probably leave it here we're almost done really if you really think about it i think it's gonna be fine honestly you know i mean we have time 
you know and don't worry when it's horror day i will make sure to title it is horror day ah in like the title thing so don't worry and a discord is coming and i will be making um like a playlist of this specific one i know you guys are enjoying seven days to die more than you're enjoying the minecraft so don't worry i'm going to keep up with the seven days that i i would like to make sure that i have seven days to die on this channel every single day of the week that's my intention and then minecraft would be at other times and then twitch streams will be thrown in there i was talking to red about this earlier yay level 55 and he was like alex just go in and like stream for like two hours here and there you know and i was like that's true like I i've always been someone who kind of looked at streaming from a perspective of being able to find like a big chunk of time like a four or five hour period of time in the day on a consistent basis where i can stream and instead of it looking instead i should be looking at it like you know stream for a couple hours at the end of the evening you know four days a week something like that you know and at least i'm i'm doing that because I, I really love it i enjoy doing it so anyways that's all the talk for this video but i will be back in the next video which will be coming out tomorrow because as always we upload here every single day and it is my intention to upload seven days to die every single day and all the other channels all the other videos will come second on this channel so enjoy the daily content let me know what you guys are thinking and subscribe we are now getting close to 60 subscribers which is amazing so thank you guys so much for coming today and i will see you in the next one later bye bye, bye.